Wizards. Detroit right now, the nine seed. Looking in on the playoff picture that the Wizards are a part of currently. Beginning with the visiting Wizards. Sam Van Gundy's Detroit Pistons. Ish Smith fans the more hot will jump it up. And Washington wins. Wall finds the open man. It's Beal. He hits on a three. Now that's critical. This is Washington. One of the number one things that John Wall has mentioned with reason for the lack of consistency, not enough ball movement as to buy Not on his shoulders without Reggie Jackson. He and Drummond have got to do it on the offensive end. Harris averaging a career high, 18.1 points. He said they took a long look at changing the starting lineup but just decided not to, but there could be changes elsewhere in the rotation with minutes as Harris. Here is Harris, the spin, the position, and the flush. Well, now that's where Drummond is the facilitator. And reacting defensively. How about you let him feel you and you try to control and dictate what's happening? It's Smith that I can just rotate him like a normal player now. Don't have to say, oh, they're at four team fouls. Now they may look to get foul Drummond. Porter with a hand in his face, and that's a well. But you're talking about a guy who's been super efficient, and here's how you do it. Scott Brooks told Otto Porter today, don't worry about shot making. Another end. Said just worry about playing hard. That's it. Five straight for Porter as Bradley got three for three. Shot. Wall trying to sneak it in. Could not. Here comes Bradley. He has Harris. Bradley storms to the rim and finishes. Finds the open man. Harris. Can it the three? Drumming the offensive board and the putback. Let me add. He's vastly improved his free throw shooting, and another turnover here. Bikes all the way in, slides it home off the turnover from Wall. Wall tried to do the old off-the-back inbound pass, and Bikes would have none of it as Mahimni ends the 11. Four straight for Washington, trying to dig out of a 15-point early hole. Bradley hits the... That is right. Last time they won 50 games as well. Oubre in the corner, hits the three. Now if there's been a Washington. Into the corner, Oubre run off this time. Goes to the rim with the lefty hammer. I'll tell you, that's all set up because this guy is... Scott hits the jumper, his first attempt off the bench. Good hands there from Meeks, getting in the lane all the way to the rim and hooks it home with the reverse. Meeks on the season, just 31% from three. In his career, he's over 37. As Moreland, one of several undrafted players that the Pistons have relied on as part of their rotation. Scott finds the cutter. It's Jody Meeks for two. And look at this, this lineup for Detroit. And again, another turnover. Otto getting into transition, and Mike Scott cleans it up. Uh, this, this. Clock down to three. Zadaransky motoring, kicking, Porter hitting. A three just as the shot clock is. Create a shot on this roster. Yeah, and, and that's where Sam Van Gundy did say late games is indeed the place we miss it most. That's Porter. Detroit has missed its last eight shots. Make it nine. Drummond, another rebound. And the putback. And Scott Brooks, hang on. Andre Drummond now with 13 rebounds. Bullock hits the three. Nine makes a three. So maybe they can get back on a roll. Oubre, center of the lane, brought it down, at its strip, got it back, puts it in. The six run, bridging the end of the quarter at the beginning of the second to take the lead themselves. Bradley sticks the landing. I guess that injection into... Porter pushing, here comes Wall, accelerates, kicks, Porter, Beal on a three. This is where they can be. Finishing 30 and 11, and now what they're doing here this season. Bullock with a hand in his face, hits the... Harris with a bunny, couldn't finish. Wall, three on one. Wall finds Oubre to the ring. And Wall the rebound. Wall, the crossover, the finish, and the foul. See, he always expects to retire at the end of that deal, even though he knows he could play a little longer. Wall lines up a three. Truth. 
see now if that is taking him out of that conversation. That's how lofty his vision is for himself. As he finds Morris in the corner on a deal at one point, the MVP of our team thus far. Wall on a steal here, flashes to the rim and lays it in. John and Markeith Morris. Can they play at a high level? Because then this, that changes his team as Bullock gets another three to go down. Steals it. Here's Smith. Open man Bullock, right back to Smith. He'll take from 18 and hit. He just missed the layup. Here comes Wall. Ten points in the quarter, six assists for the game. Beal, you bet, on a three. And Porter, the offensive rebound, sets up Beal. He got it on a three. Really good job by Marcin Gortat. No Johnny Most like broadcast. <laughs> <laughs> Wall the lob and Beal oops the alley as Washington continues to pull. Harris, Tethering. Success has got to make you want more success. Tolliver lines it up and knocks it down. They started shooting 13 of 21 in that first quarter. They shot just 31% since as Gortat just said burn on the back. He had another one that said marsupials. I mean, they're very unique. Because Padley scoops that in. A little juice from Detroit at the end of this quarter. Can they get a stop? Oubre denies it with a three. Can't hit. Tolliver batted it alive, but right to Oubre. A dead sprint to the rim for two. 45 in the quarter for Washington. He was very confident that the game was about to turn. Like things he saw at the end of the quarter, and he was right. The Wizards once down fifth first time for Detroit. He has been banged up of late. What a fortuitous hop. Kelly Oubre threw it right in the wing for game time. Are they available or not? Correct. How are you going to guard pick and rolls? What are your matchups? You know, you don't know night by night as Canard gets a Now they're incredibly young. But they haven't vaulted quite as high as maybe they could have. Is Stanley Johnson the steal? And the trailer, Tolliver, with the flush. I just love. Ball can't finish. Here comes Detroit with some momentum. They've shaved the 20 point deficit down to 10. And now seven for Detroit. Scott, center of the lane, finds Oubre. Does he get the roll? He does! Every shot down matters when you're, you've got a deficit. And the, oh! Wall nearly split the D and then the hoop. Morris will. is 19th. Here comes Smith. Smith burns through the lane, gets the body and the finish. When he gets the body, he went up against. 13 for Smith. Wall blazes and finishes with the left hand. Stop here. Morris on the offensive glass. Keeps the possession alive for Wall, who hits the three. Wow. <laughs> but he's a pro. Total pro, but very quiet. Canard, that good looking southpaw stroke. Still a five point game. Beal switched on Drummond. Finds Morris. Corner. Oubre. Three. Good. At the foul. It's a nine point Washington lead. After the four point play, Kennard with an answer. And I'm out. Beal has really struggled in fourth quarters of late. Separates here. And it's hits. For Washington. Kennard hits the three. Don't go away yet. Howard has the last 10 for Detroit. Both free throws good. Eight point game. Smith to the elbow for two. And that will do it. The Wizards fight out of a 15 point hole early to come up with a 10 point win over the Pistons. 122 to 112 the final. Kelly Oubre, a career-high 20.